Smile and nod. Okay. Lick my eyebrows? No. Lay it on smooth. Let lick my eyebrows. Let's lay it on smooth. That's two for laying on smooth. Do him. Okay. Well, I don't see why not. Huh. That sounds smoother in my head. Let's do it. I follow him up to his door. He fumbles with the key for a second. I'll knock the door, leading me inside. The moment the door closed behind us, he pushed me up against the wall and kisses me, grabbing my hips. Come on! <laughs> God damn it, this is great! I love this. Come on! <laughs> Robert takes my hand, leads me up the stairs into what I assume is his bedroom. But it's so dark that I can't see anything but Robert's intense expression. He kisses me again and I can hear him shucking off his jacket. I clumsily take off mine too. His hands roam down my chest and suddenly he's tugging at my belt. I, uh, uh, I don't normally do this. Do you want to start? Do I afraid you? Do I afraid you? <laughs> no. No. Good. <laughs> oh, man. Robert continues to unbuckle my belt and guides me to bed. Let's have some fun. I just need to highlight this whole experience. Sunlight streams in between the slats of the blinds. My head is pounding. I'm really overdid it last night. Wait a minute. This isn't my house or my new house. Oh no. Right. I look around for Robert, but I find myself alone. I'm fucking all the daddies. Hello? There's a clatter from the bathroom. The door over. Robert's fully dressed and grabs his keys. Uh, that was fun. Yeah, it, it, it was. Uh, uh, you should go. It's certainly not what I was expecting. Well, uh, talk to you later? Mm -hmm. Robert cracks a smile. Sure, the clothes are over there. Oh. I hastily get dressed and show myself out. The sun is unbearably bright and I need to lie down. I start to make my way back home and I suddenly remember. I'm a terrible father. I rush back home to throw it open.